वेलकम डियर स्टूडेंट्स जोग्राफी स्टैंडर्ड सिक्स लेसन नंबर फाइव टेम्परेचर एक्टिविटी द पर्पेंडिकुलर एंड स्लांटिंग एरिया ऑक्यूपाइड बाय द टॉर्च लाइट रेस ए फिगर द पर्पेंडिकुलर रेस ऑक्यूपाई लेस एरिया part where the rays occupy lesser area receives bright sunlight and more heat thus that surface gets heated more and the air there becomes hotter now b the slant rays occupy a larger area the part where the rays occupy a larger area receives less sunlight and so less heat thus that surface gets less heated and the air there becomes less hot the earth shape and the distribution of sun's rays the sun rays falling on the earth are straight and parallel to each other due to the spherical shape and the curvature of the surface they occupy a larger or lesser area this leads to unequal distribution of the heat received from the sun see we can see from the diagram near the equator the rays are very strong but on the poles the heat level is less thermal zones the earth is divided in three zones that is temperate torrid and frigid because of this the distribution of heat is unequal on the earth the temperature decreases from equator to the north and south see there are the three zones on the top both the places north and south there is the frigid zone afterwards temperate zone and near the equator is the torrid zone because of the spherical shape of the earth and the curvature of the surface they occupy a larger or lesser area because of this distribution of heat is unequal on the earth unequal means it is not same on all the places on the earth factors influencing the distribution of temperature means what reasons which are responsible for the distribution of temperature nearness to the sea continentality height above the mean sea level and physical setup of a region are factors that lead to diversity in the climate of a region the place which is near the sea which will have a different type of climate a place which is high on a height will have a different type of climate other than these factors like cloud cover winds vegetation cover urbanization industrialization etc also influence the local climate the heating and cooling of water with the help of this activity we will study this take two same size pots of water see we can see a and b figure same size of pots are filled with water at sunrise keep one pot outside and one pot inside the house in afternoon if we walk barefoot on the floor inside the house 
and feel the temperature of the water in the pot which was kept inside both will be less why because the sun rays are not coming in the house comparatively the land outside will be hot and the temperature of the water in the pot which was kept outside will be also warm repeat this again around 7 in the evening when the sun sets we have to repeat this activity again with the help of this activity we come to know that the land cools down faster than water because of this difference in the heating and cooling of land and water the air over the land gets heated faster and cools also fast the air over the water gets heated slowly and also loses the heat in a slow manner thank you